So, we're done. All we have to do now is run back to the van, get the rest of our stuff, figure out which of it we're going to keep, which of it we're going to sell, and then uh, calculate how far off I am from buying the medicine stick. Oh, and uh, I'm going to change outfit as well. Yippee! And we're back. Right, made it back to the van and had a night's sleep, and I've been going through some of the gear. Now, I've sold a lot of it. I sold the minigun, the missile launcher, the spare pistols, SMGs, all that sort of stuff. Made quite a lot of money, but now I'm trying to go through the rest of the stuff. Um, I, the armor, well, the combat armor. It just isn't right, is it? I mean, it's way too military for Jack. And it's medium armor as well, so you can't use the flashlight belt with it. But it's it's not even that good because it's not, I can't repair it up. And then, of course, there is the Vault 38, 34 security um, armor, which is light armor and is very good DT for light armor. But... Yeah... So, sticking with the Wanderer's Leather Armor for now. Um, for weapons, of course I got this All-American, the weapon that is on my back, and it does look nice. It is an assault rifle, I believe, and it uses the same ammo as that gun. So I'm either going to take this or that gun. But one of the things I've been noticing with that gun is it's actually difficult to aim in combat, whereas with this I just sort of aim with the sight at mid-range. So that's sort of mid-range there. When I was using that gun, mid-range was pretty random. But even at close range, it seemed to be a very hard gun to, to aim with in in iron sights. Why do we always hurt the ones we care about the most? Sorry, I was just pointing the gun at you. That's all it was. Oh, stop whining. So I think I'm going to take this. I, I do. I think I'm going to take this. But again, I'm going to leave that gun at home then. I, d I don't like my weapons to use the same ammo unless I've got so much of it. This means I don't have a pistol. Well, that's not true. I've decided to go with the 44. It does more damage. Um, let's have a look. It does a lot more damage than the that gun. 54. I mean, it it's really does do a lot more damage. And with the ammo I'm using, it is minus 6 to the DT. Um, which is nice, which is very nice indeed. So this does a lot more damage and still goes through the armor pretty damned well. Uh, there are there are no armor piercing 44 bullets, but overall, in general, this thing does so much damage, plus that minus six. It's really gonna go and, you know, I could be shooting the Legion Assassins with this, and I like it. I mean, it's such a classic, isn't it? It really is. In many ways, I prefer this to the hunting pistol. The hunting pistol's too big, I think. Do I, do I have the hunting pistol? Oh. Hunting revolver, sorry. The hunting revolver is a nice weapon, but it really does need two hands. I mean, just not a cowboy weapon, but it does do an insane amount of damage, that one. So, anyway, that's what I'm thinking. I'm going to have those two. Now, for the shotgun, I've actually got a new shotgun. I've got the riot shotgun, which, of course, looks a lot better than my old shotgun. And because I believe I've not actually shot it. I've not shot it, but I think it's auto fire when I look at it. It is 322 DPS, so it, it's got DPS slightly higher than a good submachine gun. So you can get a 10mm submachine gun. This thing does more uh, damage. Um, so this to me is the obvious thing to use instead of the sturdy caravan shotgun. And I can make pulse, pulse slugs for that as well. So I think that's... That is actually probably going to make me a lot more competent up close. A lot, actually. 
So then it comes to my mid-range and long-range weapons, and I've been using the Cowboy Repeater a lot. I think I'm still going to for... Well, I don't know. Actually, I think the All-American's probably going to beat it. But the Cowboy Repeater does do more damage per shot, which is kind of nice. However, of special interest was the Sniper Rifle, which does 42 damage... And, of course, has a very good long-range scope, so I can better uh, make those distant kills. Um, oh, why has it got a purple handle? Why has it got a purple handle? Where's my sniper rifle? Okay, interesting. So, however, and here's where things get interesting. The hunting rifle does 49 damage. Sniper Rifle, 42. Hunting Rifle, same bullets, 49. Now, it fires a little slower, but 49 is noticeably better damage. Um, the problem, of course, it has no scope. You can buy scopes, but I've not found one. So I think I'm going to take the Sniper Rifle instead of my binoculars, so that from now on, I don't need the binoculars. I'm going to use the Sniper Rifle but as soon as I find a scope for the hunting rifle, that is what I intend to take. Because it does do more damage. And honestly, I just... I prefer it. With a scope, this would look absolutely awesome. I just, I do, I prefer the way it looks. Call me strange, I just think it fits the whole cowboy thing a lot more. So, yeah... I think, then, it's going to be Sniper Rifle, Riot Gun, Pistol, and that is it. I don't think I need the Cowboy Repeater. Because... Oh, sorry, and the All-American. Because with those um, weapons, I've essentially got the, the entire range covered. Mid-range, long-range, uh, short-range with the pistol, and very, very short and close range with the uh, Riot Gun. And I think my damage output has gone up remarkably. Now, of course, I have to go off and make all the um, the ammo for it. So, that is what I'm going to do now. And I'm also going to store some of this stuff because I'm overloaded. Okay, done. Made the decision, chosen the weapons, sold the rest, made the ammo, and so on. I actually have quite a lot of caps now. I actually have 8,000 caps, which will allow me to get some of these implants installed and perhaps buy some others. Um, or some weapon mods. I haven't found any weapon mods I want yet. And although there's some weapons I quite like, the one I really want is 50,000 caps. So I've got a long way to go. And, and I sort of don't want to waste money on the other weapons because honestly, I, I feel I'll probably find them. Anti-material rifle, for example, I might find it eventually. And so I'd rather buy implants and stuff. Like, for example, the intelligence implant because the intelligence implant will immediately mean I gain at least one more skill per level. It may not sound much, but, you know, after 20, 30 levels, it will make a difference. So, you know, maybe get it now, get it early on, get an intelligence implant put in. Um, right, so the items I have got, the items I have decided to take in the end. Right, my pistol, the 44. Um, these, are, these are special bullets, they do slightly more damage, and they pierce armor quite a lot. They've got minus 6-2 armor. So this is a generally an all-round good weapon. It'll one-shot most things, so nice. I'm keeping my chopper, you know, it's, it's nice to have a melee, it really is. It's got a mod on it. I've sharpened it, I used a sharpener. Riot shotgun. Right, now, I've got about 60 shots on this. I don't know how fast it goes through them. Hopefully I won't need more than that, but I honestly I could imagine me d uh, needing that. I've got 24 pulse slugs in case we meet any serious robots. I might save those for the more dangerous robots. You know, sentry bots for example. And I made 10 dragon breath shots. I don't know what they are. I'm assuming they... Do they set fire to something? Because they do less damage, but I'm assuming they do something else. 
I have got the All American, and as you can see, this is probably going to be my weapon of choice, just judging by the amount of ammo I've taken. I've got about 180 ammo, um, just normal ammo, and I've taken 100 armor piercing ammo. So this is probably going to be the, the main weapon of choice. And finally, the sniper rifle. I have got 30 bullets. They're pretty good ones. They do more damage. Uh, they've got less spread, so they're more accurate. And they do pierce armor slightly. Uh, not a huge amount, but a little. So, on the whole, good all-round bullet. I have taken 20 armor-piercing bullets, just in case. Uh, maybe we use them on death claws, that type of thing. If, uh, to be honest, a death claw, I think, at the moment. I still want to run away. So that is my arsenal. Oh, not completely true. I've got the silence pistol. I always take this with me, and I've got about 50 hollow points. This is just for, you know, if I get some chances. This It's such a light weapon, and the bullets are really light that is, I might as well bring it along with me. So that's it. That is the arsenal. And now what I want to do is I've got three implants, plus I'd like to buy the intelligence one. I think I'm going to head off to... What am I doing? What? Van! I'm going to take the van. Because I'm lazy now. <laughs> Get a van. Why would I, why would I want to walk? Because I can now... When it... What? Oh, so... I thought I could go to the medical centre. My God, I've got to run. I'll be exhausted by the time I get there. Fine. At least I'm, uh, you know, at least it's light and I have slightly better visibility. One good thing now is not having to take the binoculars. So if, if, I, if I want to do some scouting, I can use either the All-American, which is not bad, or, and this is probably the better one, the sniper rifle. Because I think it has slightly better zoom. Do you know what I'd like to do? I'd like to figure out how to... One of the things I don't like is the, the mouse sensitivity seems to reduce when you zoom. So, for example, when I aim now, it's it's not as... It doesn't turn as fast as when I'm... I, I, I don't like that, to be honest. I, I generally like my uh, my aim to remain constant. I find it a lot easier to judge, so if I turn around and it slows, I have... And I think this just turns too slowly. It probably helps with aim if you've not got a good mouse, but no thanks. Alright. There we go. Clinic. Okay. Hello. You're back. Do you need medical attention? Yes. First of all, I'd like you to perform... I want to see what my well. current um, implants do. Right, that's the bar to one. Scanner implant. West Tech Augmented Reality Scanner was designed to provide computer-assisted combat intelligence in real time. When moving behind enemy lines, it assists in evaluating potential threats and like... This is a really, really good um, cybernetic implant. I don't know if you've seen it um, in action. It's very cool. It's a little high-tech for my uh, tastes. Um, right, I'm, I'm going to save a slot for the intelligence one then. And... Body. What do I have? Synthetic lung implants. Synthetic elements are implanted at several key locations in the respiratory system, greatly enhancing the user's oxygen supply. Initially developed for victims of chronic lung diseases, these implants were later utilized in the civilian sector, firefighters and divers, as well as by the military. Sprint AP drain, minus 25%, and water breathing. That's pretty nice. I think I'd like that. Stealth nanobots implant. Um, presents his latest breakthrough in stealth technology. Nanobots reside on the user's skin, eliminating the need for any special device to generate a stealth field. No, it's again, it's too... It's a little too high-tech for me, I'm afraid. Alright. How about here? No, I didn't think so. Alright. Then... You're back. Do you um, show me what you have for Very sale. Well. Let's see, let's have a look what these implants are worth. These implants are worth a lot. 
Right. The big problem, of course, is, is there's no point me selling them to you because you don't have enough money. However, I'd like to buy an implant. Which surgery option are you considering? The intelligence one. For 4,000 caps, I can install a logic coprocessor. Do it! Make me smart. Here's the caps. Very well. Okay. Take care. Thanks. Oh, she, of course, she just adds... She just adds, You're back. right? Yes. Do you need medical attention? Yeah, no. Um, now. Very well. You should have. So that four thousand doesn't go anywhere. Oh, that's annoying, isn't it? I was hoping. Fine. I'd like you to perform cybernetic surgery. Very well. Okay. Um, logic coprocessor. Plus one. Nice. And I also want the synthetic lung one installing. All right. So that's 800. Yes, I'm sure. Yes, I'm sure. The big question is, do you get that 800? Because... You're back. Do you need... No, I want to see what you got for sale. Very well. Oh, you just don't get any of this... Do you actually have anything I want? Oh, doctor's bag. Yes, you do. And I might as well take all these for making more doctor's surgical mask. Red resistance plus five. Poison resistance. Medicine fi Hello. Yeah, what I was hoping to do was sell you some of... I don't know. Where have they gone? Items, ammo, miscellaneous. Right, you see, here's the thing. I think, yeah, I don't quite know how much. Let's have a look. If I take this in, I suppose I could do that, couldn't I? Then, um, all, and give her some of those back. Actually, that'll do. There you go. I get a thousand caps out of it. She gets the scanner implant, which I do not intend using. And I get a surgical mask as well. Nice. All right. So now I am intelligence eight. Intelligence eight. Nice. Um, stats. Don't be daft. Stats. Intelligence eight. Perception nine. Brilliant. Smart and observant. That is me. And I can now sprint for 25% longer. Okay, little bit of a crash there. And I have a feeling it's something to do with autosave. I re-enabled autosave. Why have you got your gun out? I don't have my gun out. Why do you have your gun out? And why are you holding it as if you were holding a pistol? In fact, you're not even holding it like... I mean, don't get me wrong, it looks kind of cool on you, but it's freaking me out a little bit. Yeah, anyway, so I think autosave may have been the culprit there. I re-enabled the game's autosave, which was stupid. I can't remember why I did that. So I've disabled it. It might also be because I'm running a world of pain, but I don't think so. I don't think it's any of the mods I've installed. I'm pretty sure it's it's that. i got to stop looking at it. That's really bugging me. Um, I'm using Chasm anyway. Chasm does all the auto-saving for me, so God knows what I was thinking. I was testing out. Right, so I can run basically 25% more. Which could be useful in some circumstances. Just la allow me to get to cover a little bit better. But more importantly, it means I can run and sprint a teeny bit faster over long distances. Right. I'm thinking we go in here. I'm thinking we go in here and find out what's what. If you remember that, that lady, Cass, she told us we should come here and check out the Crimson Caravan. There you go. Because they might have jobs for us. And that is what we need. Job. Okay. That's a bit freaky, isn't it? Okay. Oh, we're 
in the same clothes, same hats. In fact, they all look the same. I think we've discovered a cloning facility. Don't talk to them. If I go near them and they something like, I love my work, then we're going to leave quickly. Okay. Ringo! Hello. Yes, I remember you. I saved your life. Hey there. Here's the rest of the payment I promised you back in Good Spring. Oh, you did? Yes. Money. 150 bottle caps. Are you serious? Really? 100... Oh, never mind. Who's in charge here? Alice McLafferty runs the Crimson Caravan. You can find her over in the main office. Over in the main office. What the road? Don't care. What's next for you? Also don't care. Or maybe he has a job for I'm me. I'm getting ready to run a caravan up towards Utah. There's a town called New Canaan, which is supposed to be pretty prosperous. All right. The Crimson Caravan doesn't have any branches out that way. So it'll be up to me to get things started. Here you go. Nothing. No. Nope. I'll see you around. Probably not. Can't imagine I'm going to come back and chat to you. Hello? Civilizing Prim will show what we can do for everyone else in these territories. Okay. Blake! If you're looking to buy or sell, you've come to the right man. The Crimson are you Caravan Ill? Company has the widest selection in the wasteland. Why are your lips green? What have you been drinking? Your eyes as well. Dude, I don't know what drugs you're taking, but you need to cut back. Can you answer some questions for me? Maybe. What do you want to know? Oh, where I can find 50,000 caps for a start. Where does the Crimson Caravan Company get its merchandise? Trade So routes, I can go friend. steal it. Trade routes. Just about every major town in the wasteland has a Crimson Caravan branch in it. Okay, do your caravans ever have trouble from bandits? Out here, we usually split our caravans into smaller bands. That way, we don't lose everything if they get hit. It's not very efficient, though. But hopefully, we'll be able to start running larger caravans once things get civilized. But if you split them up, doesn't that mean the small caravans are more likely to get, like, wiped out? Don't you lose more people? I would have thought safety in numbers. Where are you from? Don't care. Let, that's all. Let's talk about something else. else. Something interesting. Show me what you have for sale. Can do. You have... Actually, not such bad stuff, I suppose. I'm not going to buy from you when there's a gun runners around. The Desperado cowboy hat. Oh, we've already got one of those. Um... Thank you. Also, thank you. And thank you. Oh. Mm, so, you know what? I'll take the lot. Honestly, I'm not totally sure I need Radaway anymore. I really, honestly, don't think I'm going to get that much radiation that I can't make it back to a um, town and get cured. Can I sell you anything? Because I hate using money, but I do want... All of the above things. Okay, that's not too bad. Just sell him a load of currency. I'm getting money out of this deal. And I got a new hat. Goodbye. See ya. And sort those lips out, mate. Right, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. Items. Desperado cowboy hat. I like this one. I think I've checked this one out before with this armor, haven't I? I don't like it. I don't like it. I do not like it. I like... I don't know why. This just works for some reason. Oh, tell you the other thing. We've got this surgical mask. Oh. Okay, look a bit weird. Why can't I wear glasses and a surgical mask? What does it give me again? Five medicine. And rad resistance. And poison resistance, but rad resistance mostly. Um, I'll remember that next time I'm in a radiated vault. However, why can't I wear that north? You know what? That I'm fixing. That I am fixing. All right, we've got more rad away, more uh, hydra as well, and some doctor's bags. I'm feeling relatively prepared. Civilizing Prim will show what we can do for everyone else in these territories. Here we go. Crimson Caravan Main Office. This is what we're looking for. Hello? Caravan here. No, thank you. 
Hello, Alice McClafferty. Welcome to the Crimson Caravan Company, New Vegas branch. What may I do for you? Give me lots of money with as little work as humanly possible. I'd like to know more about the Crimson Caravan Company before I... Um... Certainly. What would you like to know? How much are you going to pay me? How long have you been in business? The Crimson Caravan Company has been in business for over 130 years. We're partially responsible for the progress in the NCR. Oh, then you should have lots of money. Does the Crimson Caravan had have any competition? Well, the gunrunners continue to dominate the weapons market. Okay. And the Mormon traders from New Canaan control the majority of the northern routes. Okay, you're well dressed for this place. That's a little personal, isn't it? But, you know what? Normally, I oversee company operations at the hub in California. However, the New Vegas branch has been underperforming in recent years. Given the conditions here, it's not hard to see why. I'll change all that soon okay. enough. I don't have any more questions. Let's talk about money. Okay. Um, something else. Is there anything else I can do for you? Pay me. Uh, I'm a <laughs> little bit one track here, I realize, but I have a gun and I want to buy it and I need huge amounts of money, so... I'm afraid we have no current openings for caravanners or guards, but I am in need of a runner. Oh, I can run. Running, I can... I even have an implant that helps me run even... But wait, what? Completed Cass's drowning his sorrows at the Mojave Outpost. Had advice, go and work for the Crimson Caravan. Pitch in at the Crimson Caravan Company if you're looking for caravan work. Okay, I'll take it. Where do I have to run? Deliver this invoice to Dr. Hildern. You can find him somewhere inside Camp McCarran. All right, Dr. Hildern. Camp McCarran. Goodbye. It's been a pleasure. Really, it's not. Right, we've got to go to ca Camp McCarran. That... Camp McCarran. Yes, no, yes, I've been meaning to go there anyway. Um, quests. You can depend on me. Yes, indeed. Alright. Gun runners. My truck. Alright, so we're off there to Camp McCarran. Deliver a note. Can we go this way? I think we can go this way. Or it's just. You never know. It's kind of weird not having my. Um, I tell you what, I should probably start carrying as my primary weapon this thing. Just in case you walk out and there happen to be uh, Legion or something. No? I think we're going in that direction. I believe so. Alright. Inaccessible. Alright, let's go. We're going past the gun runners, and then I think it's in a pretty much a straight line in that direction. Whoa. Freeside East Gate. Okay, we we really should visit Vegas, actually. We should go into Freeside and visit Vegas. But we have got a job that just involves running. Hopefully running without getting shot at. I think we're heading in this direction. And I've not been here before. Perhaps I should be a little bit more careful. Oh, I don't know. I, whenever I hear that music, I know I'm in NCR territory. And I'm probably say... Keep out. What's that? Isn't it? Isn't isn't that terrible, right? If it hadn't had a sign saying "keep out," I would never have thought to go in there. Emergency underground. Right. Emergency underground access. DB drag. Oh, I've got the wrong. Um, I don't want that. Requires a key. Hatch to emergency underground access. Alright, we have an emergency underground access. We also have an upstairs. Foot locker. Okay, why is somebody leaving presents for me? Okay. 
Well, we got some fuel for the van. Right, we're going in this... Can we... Alright, what's this? This looks like a farm. Can I... Probably that would be rude, wouldn't it? That would probably get me shot at, wandering through someone's field, picking their crops. What's this? NCR sharecropper for our... Where's... Where are... Okay. When we were in the vault, when we were in the vault, we had to... Oh, we had to free some people. We had to free some people. And one of the options was... Some... Not freeing the people. And that would please the share crop farmers or something. These people. Oh, right. They probably need water. And... When I saved those people, it didn't give water. Something like that. Pfft, farmers. Andrew, I wonder who I've saved. Okay, where the hell am I going? No, we're heading in the right direction. Looks reasonably safe. It's what is that? That is NCR. I'm, I'm going to go out on a limb here and say this is pretty safe. Oh, right. This is the sign. This is the sign. You know where the um, desert ranger takes the shot? Or was he was he taking it from up there? No, it always looks like he's right on the sign, doesn't it? He's up there taking the shot down there. Actually, that probably means it's not quite as safe as. Oh, all right. Well, there's NCR enough around here. I think. I think we're all right. Maybe stuff to loot. McCarran. Camp McCarran. I'm here to see Dr. Hilden. Fine. Can I actually... Ooh. No. Patrolling the Mojave Don't almost makes steal me ammo from right. them. Right, so, well, this is a pretty big place. Where the hell are we going? Um, probably over there. Yes! Almost certainly over here. Okay, electricity engineer. I'm looking for Dr. Hilden. Who are you? Major Dattry! If it's bad news, you can take it up with the Colonel. If it's good news, it better involve some dead fiends. Um, I've only met dead fiends. Um, you're having trouble with the fiends? Damn right I am. And I'm paying bounties. Ooh. I've got three fiends I want dead, and I don't give a goddamn how it gets done. That sound like something that interests you? Um, yes. Yes, in fact, it does. Good. That's damn good. I figure it's about time we got lucky out here, so maybe you can snuff one of these maniacs. First one calls herself Violet. God knows why. The name is the prettiest thing about her. Spends most of her time with a pack of vicious dogs. Then there's Driver Nafai. He's fast, and he's brutal. Killed about a dozen of my men with a goddamn driver iron. Hence his name. All right. And finally, Cook Cook. Rapist, pyromaniac, and damn good chef if you believe the fiends we've captured. Probably the craziest of the lot. I'm not gonna feed you any bullshit. These aren't your common Vegas trash. They've all killed good NCR men, and plenty of mercs, too. You go after them, any of them, you're in for a hell of a fight. So, which one is it gonna be? Any of them. We'll take the first one. Violet. Violet it is. Wish I could give you more advice on how to bring her down, but we know less about her than the other two. Just watch out for Doesn't the dogs. Shooting her she raises work? them herself. Might as well be their mother, and they never leave her side. Shoot her and dogs. Got it. I can handle dogs. Where do I need to go? Good question. Fiend territory is, is southeast question. of here, but they range all over the area. None of them stays in any one place for long. Anything else I need to know? One more thing. If you want the full reward, you need to bring me a recognizable head. My superiors need proof they're gone. That means no headshots, no decapitations till after they're dead, and no damage to the face. If you want to be safe, aim for the chest. Fine. You bring me a head that looks like a rotten tomato, people will be doubting, and I won't be authorized to pay the entire bounty. Good luck to you, and don't get careless. I never get careless. 
Um, tell me about... The, no, I've changed my mind. No, I've not. What do you know about fiends? Back of drugged out killers. They're addicted to every stim, every pill, every psychoactive enema on this fucked up earth. Everyone? Right. All right, we've got another bounty. Excellent. We've already got a bounty. That's quests. We've got an old bounty. New Vegas bounties. Quigley. we got to kill Quigley, who is over here. And he said the fiends were to the southeast, right? It's probably... Let's have a look. Three card bounty. Yeah, so Quigley... Actually, they're not too far from each other. We could get Quigley and... Violet over here. That will be two bounties in one area. I like it. Uh, let's just finish this delivery. We'll deliver the note. Are you coming? We'll deliver the note. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say... It's in this building, isn't it? This is the... What is it? McCarran Airport, Las Vegas. Okay. Any door? Any door. So we're looking... Whoa. It is dark. Okay. Oh. And uh, they're not going to let me take stuff. Where am I heading, though? Local map. Oh. Way over there. Okay, this place is pretty big. Hello, are you the receptionist? Hello? There's a lot you more lost. troops here than we thought. No wonder we couldn't hold Helios 1. Okay. I'm hearing... Is that a train? Have they got trains running? Was it in this direction? Yes! Authorised personnel only. Hello, Dr. Hilda... Angela Williams, I presume. A little busy at the moment. But I can talk. You look doctorish. What is this place? This? The OSI lab. We don't get many visitors. The smell puts people off, I think. What smell? Nobody ever said science would smell clean and fresh. Anyway, you get used to it if you give it some time. Okay, that was a little weird. Are you a scientist? I know, I don't sound the part. Get raised by Brahmin ranchers and you never lose the twang. Drives Hildren crazy. But I know every Hilden. inch of the power grid from who's That's... a dam to Shady Sands. That's what we do here. Try to optimize the power output from the dam. Some of the others are working on an agricultural project, but truth be told, they aren't making much progress. Not yet, anyway. Wait. If you're, like, an electrical engineer, why, why are there all these, like, sort of chemical things on your desk? What's your role here? Head researcher. Mostly on the dam project, but I help out on other things when they need me. Gotta be flexible. Okay, need help with anything? Do you have a you job mean, for me? give you work? Yep. No, that'd be up to the administrator, Hildern. He's back there in his office. Between you and me, I don't think he ever leaves. Plenty of mercs go in to see him, though. Ah, mercenaries. I can't say. What for? We're not supposed to talk about the research. Not the details. If you're interested, I'm sure he'd see you. Well, I have a message for him, so yes. Goodbye. Nice to meet you. If you need anything, I'm almost always in the lab. Okay, so this is the lab. Really? This is what you call a lab. Dr. Hildern, yes. A pleasure to meet you. I'm Dr. Thomas Hildern, Director of Operations, OSI East. I presume you're here about Vault 22? Um, no, I'm, um, yeah! Vault 22, tell me all about it. Wonderful. Straight to it, then. Have you signed the release forms? No? Where Doesn't would matter. It? We'll keep that to ourselves. Okay. Vault 22, where to begin? Where is it? <laughs> Save the sales pitch, just tell me what you want me to do. No, I'm listening. Just be polite, the man's about to tell us where a vault is. Imagine, if you will, the wasteland in bloom. Vast fields of corn that grow from seeds and produce their bounty in the space of a month. Orchards of trees, their branches weighed halfway to the ground, hung with fat, ripe oranges, a harvest that could feed a city or a nation. Boring. And all of this, all this, requiring no more than a few drops of precious water and the efforts of only a handful of human farmers. No, Impossible. wait. 
Wait, 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 wait. He's chatting about unlimited food. That would be worth a fortune. Nothing is impossible if it makes me money. Precisely. Science has proven that truth a thousand times over. But how many wasteland savages believe it? Present company accepted, of course. The bounty I describe Wait. to you is no idle fantasy. Did it exists in savage? primitive form only a few miles from where we stand. We he need only reach out and savage. unlock its secret. For that, the OSI needs you. Right, yes. Simple scientific discovery is never so simple as that. Tell me more. Yet, um... No, just tell me more. Where is it? Good. I thought I sensed the kindred soul in you, beneath the wasteland veneer. I believe that the inhabitants of Vault 22 God, like unlock him. the secrets of vegetative growth. Plants are spilling from their gate. No one tends them. No one waters them. Yet they multiply and spread in all directions. Find the reason for this miraculous growth, and I promise you the OSI will see that you are generously compensated. All right. I will... Yes, fine. I will do it. Good. No need to check in with the NCR authorities. I can authorize your payment from OSI accounts. Sounds Vaults good to me. typically contain a server room on a lower level where they would have backed up their research data. A computer room, you understand? Yeah, it's not Download the first vault the I've visited. on the central server to your Pip-Boy. And you'll be certain to bring me any notes or samples that you find, won't you? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, sure. Of course I will. That's, that's what I'm going to do. Anything else I should know? I thought it was a fairly straightforward assignment. It's a simple question of retrieving the data, which shouldn't prove overly challenging. Downloading the data will be handled by your Pip-Boy. You might think of yourself as a mere means of conveyance. Uh, no insult intended, of course. Oh, really don't like you very much, gotta admit. Fighting those impulses again. Um, I have an invoice for you from Alice McClaverty. From Alice? I'll see that she's paid right away. Crimson Caravan runs okay. a tight operation. Even out here in the waste, wouldn't do to keep them waiting. Was there oh. anything else? Or were you just here about the invoice? It's just the invoice. I have some qu completed. Excellent. I've got to return to Alice. Before I do that, I want to go and get these bounties. We're in the neighborhood. I have some questions. Oh? What might those be? Tell me about OSI. The Office of Science and Industry. It's a rather expensive topic. I could talk for hours, but I'm sure I'd bore you. I'm sure you Suffice would too. Suffice to say, we are the leading edge of the NCR. Our work focuses on practical matters. Medicine, engineering, biology. The dam, for instance. OSI roots its energy supply to our cities in the West. That's only one responsibility of this office. Okay. So you're the director, you control what the responsibilities, what do, you, what do you think of NCR's chances against the Legion? To be frank, I have no idea. I leave the fighting to Colonel Shu, and I expect him to leave the science to me. Too many people have opinions on things they know nothing about. And the more ignorant they are, the more opinions they have. I had noticed this, yes. Tell me more about the OSI. The Office of Science and... In no, change my mind, change my mind, change my mind. What other responsibilities does this office have? We aid some programs the Republic has sponsored involving sharecropper farms in the area. But those haven't panned out too well from what I hear. There have been complaints about the amount of water we're supplying. But those are just excuses for lack of diligence, I'm sure. Yeah... Do you control the dam? Directly? No. But we attempt to maximize its output. You have no idea how difficult it is to provide power to an entire nation. Our efforts at Helios 1 held a great deal of promise until some drifter blew in from the waste and managed to reroute the power. As to where the power is going, who knows? Can you imagine a drifter outsmarting professional scientists? Uh, only yep. in New Vegas. Um, yeah, that's terrible. That's, that's the trouble with this terrible. wasteland. Too many damned variables. No one can account for them all. It's awful. The things some people do, eh? So you... <laughs> So you're the boss, are you? You're not. No, you could, no, you're not. You said you would. No, he didn't. Yes. Goodbye. Goodbye. Otherwise, he wouldn't have to sneak around. Did Dr. Hildern. This really isn't any of my business, but did he give you a job? You just said it's not your business. Go on, then. Why does she want to talk to me? I shouldn't say anything. I know that. But you're not the first person Hildern sent out to the vault. There were a lot of mercs, one after another. None of them came back. Then, about a week ago, there was a scientist, I knew it. Keely. She's unusual. Not the sort of person you'd expect, but she's an absolute genius, and 
And he didn't mention her? Nope. Not even her name? Nope. Or any of the other Mercs? Nope. <sighs> Maybe a Dr. Hilden and I need to have a long, long no, talk. No, wait. I don't mean to see any harm come to Dr. Hildern. I do. Unless by talk, you just mean talk. Nope. Listen, I make a fair wage, but I'm not rich. Not by any means. Maybe my kind of money wouldn't appeal to your average Merc. But I'm willing to pay you if you'll find Keeley and make sure she's safe. Isn't right leaving her out there. No idea if she's alive or dead. Um, yeah, if you're paying me, I will look out for her. She's gone to the same place I'm supposed to be heading anyway, right? Vault 22. I had a good feeling about you. Moment you walked in. I have I that mean, effect on people. Um, I have some questions. Of course. Do Anything. I? What? What? What can you tell me about Keely? Yes. Keely's brilliant. An absolute genius. She plays at being mean, but it's all a front. When you've lived as long as she has, you get defensive around new people. Who wants to make a friend when you know you'll outlive them? Okay, so she's a ghoul then, I'm guessing. I couldn't get her to say, but she talked about the war. The Great War, when the bombs fell, like she'd been there. God, that was a so, while ago. So, I'm guessing pretty old. 200 years? Maybe more. Do Keely and Hilden get along? Like a Brahmin and a Deathclaw, though I'm not sure which would be which. Bad analogy, maybe. They're both Deathclaws in their way. Keely hates Hildern. She says he's more politician than scientist, and gets in the way of true discovery. And Hildern hates Keely because... Well, because every time they meet, she makes him look like an ass. In front of important people, usually. Um, Hilden does not need any help making himself look like an ass. Um, what's your role here? Haven't I asked that? I've asked that. What do you think of Dr. Hilden? I'd say that was pretty obvious. Hilden mentioned the followers of the apocalypse. My father used to say good things about them, but that was years ago. Back when they teach farmers and ranchers about crop rotation and the like. Nowadays, they've changed. They're doing what they can to discredit the NCR. Give us a bad name with the locals. Dr. Hildern trained with them years ago. Not me, though. I'm an OSI girl. Alright. Um, I hear the food around here is pretty bad. Do I? Did I? I? When did I hear? I didn't hear that. Right. Stay safe. It's my middle name. Could you... Excuse me? Hello. Hello. Even the stupid NCR is investing in new research. We're getting left in the dust. Like, why do we care? Uh, right, so... Interesting, interesting. I have... You can depend on me. I've got to go back and see Alice, which I'm going to do, but I'm think... Ooh, Vault 20... Oh, that's quite far out, actually. Well, we're going to head up there sooner or later. We are definitely going to head up there sooner or later, but for now, I want to do these... Um, these bounties. Definitely. Let's get these bounties sorted out, which probably means what I should actually do is put... Yeah. We can go vault hunting later. Right now, I'm in the mood to go and shoot somebody. Veronica was getting awfully chatty in there, wasn't she? What's on your mind? You can't help but notice that the Brotherhood barely exists to these people out here. We're like an urban myth. No real presence on the outside. We just don't adapt like we should. Used to be that all you needed to get your way was a suit of power armor and a laser rifle. Now, people are armed and organized. They're not afraid. But we still stick to our old approach because it's all we know. Um, power armor and laser rifles are still effective. True. Brother is living in the past. Eventually they'll have to change. Probably more true. It's worked for this long. There must be something... No, they're going to have to change. I think you're right. Because I'm We're right. getting desperate. Hardly enough people to sustain ourselves as a chapter. They'll see the light. Sooner or later. But I get the feeling if I don't take matters into my own hands, the change won't come in time to make a difference. Okay. Have you got that off your chest now? Do you need a hug or something? Or See you around. Can we get on with, you know, going off and shooting people? Good grief. I have to go and get the only Brotherhood soldier who's all carey sherry. I think we're heading in this direction. Yes. Maybe we should just quickly check this place a little as well. I think we're heading in that direction. And we're looking for Violet. 
Okay, last time we came near a building like this, there were mines everywhere. Let's keep our eyes open. This is El Rey Motel. Alright. I don't really think we need anything here. Okay. I saw your point... Who are you pointing? I mean, what are you pointing at? And who... Who are you pointing for? Is there something over I there? I got this assignment. I was hoping there'd be more gambling. I see somebody over there. The other side of the bridge. Did anyone else see? I think we've got fiend. Yeah, oh, that was a bat. That was a mistake. Excuse me. I was trying to sneak. We've got fiends. But we've also got sniper rifles. Sniper rifle. When it is there anyone here as well? No, that's got NCR flag. That's no guarantee, I guess. Okay, so we're 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 heading in this direction. It's I think it's a little further beyond this, but it looks like we're heading into fiend territory. One. I kind of feel like it's a bit of overkill. Sniper rifle. I kind of want to use this, but there's no way in hell I'm going to make that shot with this pistol, is there? <coughs> I gotta try. I'm dying to try. <laughs> oh, did you guys see that? I should get a round of applause for that. Silent and deadly. Jack the Ninja. Alright. Oh! Okay. He spotted his de dead friend. Why am I changing to armor piercing? That was silly. I want to change this again. Okay. Guys, guys, guys. I get the feeling you're about to attack. Stop it! No, really stop it! Why are you doing this to me? Could you two... Do not engage! Do not engage! You ruined my whole sneaky thing here. We were doing this seriously silent killer thing. Idiots. Okay. But we are definitely in the right place, I guess. Oh, ammo. Right. Oh. Engage. Yes, I will take them. It's one of the nice thing about having these weapons with scopes now is I can stay armed and still scout ahead with the scope. Locked. Easy. Thank you very much. Frag mine. Don't. And we leveled. Hey, that's level 12! Alright, so everyone's nagging me to take lockpicks, generally speaking, which is tempting. Um, 14 skill points! I've got an extra point of intelligence, why, why am I still only at 14 skill points? Don't I have the intelligence? Did I not install the intelligence thing, or does, does it not make a difference? 7 and 8 just made no difference, that's annoying. Right, well I'm good enough at medicine, oh, you know what though? If I took medicine now, along with my medical mask, I could make stim packs. I oh, know. Sneak. Repair. No. Science. Tempting. Ooh! I take science to 40, and with a book, I will be able to crack into... Oh, I just... I think lockpicks just seems to be the way, isn't it? It's just... 
I think I should just bump lock picks until I get to the point where I can pick any lock. I can't stand doors I can't get through. Now, this lock pick plus a book makes 68. I still can't go through the hard ones. Fine. Continue. And let's have a look at the new silent running. Now that's a huge temptation. Tech wizard. Formative science and repair. No, thank you. Tactical strategist. You have mastered the use of vats. Unless your overall damage in vats is No, thank you. Sniper. Um, not useful uh, because I don't use vats. Hobbler. Opponent's legs. Again, vats. Auto addict. You've trained yourself to use... Oh, sorry. Autodidact. Pout no. Alertness. I like the sound of that one. You learn to keep your senses alert to any danger. When crouched and not moving, you gain plus two to perception. Mm, I have an eddy. Two phases. i got to be honest. Right now, silent running sounds like the better option. Plenty of other perks I'd like to have, including things like this. The where was it? This iron handshake and cyber limbic, and then there's another one which gives you the ones in the chest. Um, I would l I'd like more implants, but I don't have money to buy them anyway. So silent running seems to be the best option. I really am ninja. Well, I'm ninja as long as I tell you guys to stay there. I'm keeping them on do not engage. They're annoying me. I mean, I suppose you could argue. Ooh, I'm stuck. Oh, n really? Seriously? I'm st I'm actually stuck. Oh. Got it. I suppose you could argue that I'd already shot this guy, so, um, you know. But I wanted to shoot them one at a time in my own time. Thank you very much. Fiend. Cowboy repeater. I don't need it, but I will take it for uh, repairing. All right. Okay, building. You know what? I can't get up there. Guys, I brought something to read. Yeah, stay here. You're bugging me slightly. I'm heading off. I'm stealthy, you're not. Okay, what the hell is this? I don't think that's where we're going. I think that's where we're going. I'm pretty sure that's where we're going. Actually, yes, it is. We're heading in this direction. Trains. All right. This is probably one of the most dangerous territories I've been in. Okay. You can follow me now, guys. I think we're safe. Oh, please tell me they're coming. Case 30. Guys? Guys? Oh. Oh, you morons! You utter morons! You should have come the same way as me. Something's shooting at you now. I think. Or maybe not. Maybe it's something shooting at something else? We're going that way, but... Should tell them to, something to stay read. there just in case. That doesn't look like a fiend. Alright, nothing to do with us. Aww. Just when the standing around was getting exciting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
We're going through this door here, and I'm afraid I have a horrible suspicion we're going to be meeting pretty much. There you go. Wait for my signal, right? Wait for my signal. South Vegas ruins. Oh, God. All right. Okay, you guys. Should have brought something to read. Stay here. And do not engage. Okay. Right, we've got... Now this... Oh, God, yeah, right. Two... F three fiends. Three fiends. Okay, it's not so bad, not so bad. I'm gonna take that one out first. Now, the question is, do they know? Oh, they've noticed! Okay. Eddie's going, I see one. Oh, you're dead. Okay. Still alive. Nice. We got them all? No. No, no. Oh, God. We got loads. We got... We got loads of them. Nope. I'm gonna make you scream. Uh, uh, what have you done? I've killed lots of people. Fire at will, I think. Oh! Ow! No, I'm burning! I'm dead! I'm dying! I'm dying! I'm dying! I'm dying! I'm dying! Fire at will! Fire at will! No! Okay. Okay. Well, that wasn't good! Okay, guys, 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 follow me, though. Follow me. Just when the standing around was getting exciting. No, it wasn't getting exciting. Come, follow, and sneak. And, um, of course, crippled. My god. <sighs> One guy. Oh, look at that. I can't even see my pit, boy. Head. Oh. Wow. Fine. Doctor's bag. Luckily, I've got lots of them. My god. I don't know how many, um... <laughs> oh, long barrel sawn off. Nice. We got a mod. I don't know how many um, stim backs I took there, but I got a bit panicky. Okay. There were a few of them that... Whoa. My mind's made a bit of a hole. Okay. Oh, made plasma rifle. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Q35 matter modulator. Is that... What is that? Is that another weapon? Is it? Is that a weapon? I have to look at this. We're going to find a safe space to... Isn't that the same as the thing you've got? <sighs> you dropped it again, didn't you? Come on. <sighs> You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? No, I'm giving you a weapon. Pick it up if you get disarmed. You, you're doing this so I'll let you punch things, aren't you? Oh, I saw another one. I saw another one. I saw another one. Really? No way. Killed a few of them over here, I'm pretty sure. Assault rifle. I'll take it. Bottle cap. Is that it? Is that it? 
go check you out in a bit. Now we're head. No, we won't. No, we won't. We got. We got. Now what have I done? Do not engage. Do not engage. And that meant you too, mate. Don't you dare shoot my guys. All right. I'm gonna set you fire at will. No, wait for mine. We had at least one more there. I think. Wrong one. We're heading in that direction. Are you having issues there, Veronica? All right, where's the weapon? If you've dropped it again, Ooh, I Ooh, got something good for me? No, you've got it. Okay. Is it a dress? Okay. I don't need a vomit rifle. All right. Yeah, I think we're going in this direction. Off we go around there. Hiding behind cars is actually not a really good idea. Oh, hello. Ammo. Oh, all grenades. Okay, we got more. No, one more. Um... Something else is shooting. No? Okay. Okay. What's laser pistol? Nice. More stuff. doing we got oh we got trap is what we got okay we got grenade trap can I oh I can activate the trip wire just in case was it anything else no god that was lucky god I almost stepped on that Mines. A lot of mines here. Alright. We still haven't found Violet. She should be over there, but we're looking for dogs. There was another guy there. Find Vault 3? Find Vault 3. We found Vault 3. Are we stood on it? Is it here? Down there maybe, down there. Okay. Psycho. Uh, yeah. We're gonna have to sort some of this stuff out in a minute. Okay, we found another vault. Veronica, you know what vaults mean? Vaults mean stuff. Is it Vault three? Okay. No power armor, no energy weapons, and they're giving the NCR more trouble than we ever did. Seriously? Hmm. Could you shush hey, with You got a second? Well, yeah, it's not like we're in the middle of enemy territory or anything. Let's have a chat. What? The Brotherhood is failing. I've always known that. If we don't change course, we're going to fall apart or fade away. But until recently, I haven't understood where we went wrong or how to fix it. I think I need to go home. Now? Right now? Can we... Can it... Can it... Can it wait? Uh, 
I'll take you back there the first chance I get. How about that? Great. Thanks. Thank you. I'll encourage people to name their non-ugly children after you. Seriously. Brilliant. Can we sneak it? Thank you. This might be why the Brotherhood's in trouble. Standing up in the middle of a battlefield going, My feelings are a little bruised. Can we chat? Yippee, yeah.